These sweet rolls, filled with a cream cheese, mandarin zest, and a mix of berries, are very delicious and easy to make. They are perfect for the summer months. Enjoy! Pour 200 grams or 3 quarter cups of milk in the bowl of the stand mixer. Add 100 grams or 2 large eggs. Add 100 grams or half a cup of sugar and 100 grams or a third of a cup of sourdough starter at 50% hydration. To make this 50% hydration sourdough starter, combine in a bowl 25 grams or 1 and a 3 quarter tablespoons of water. Add 25 grams or 1 tablespoon of sourdough starter and 50 grams or a third of a cup of flour. Mix all the ingredients with a silicone spatula until all the ingredients come together. Then, take the dough out of the bowl and place it on your working table. Knead the dough for a minute or two until the dough has a nice soft consistency. Place the dough back in the bowl and cover it with a lid. I am making double the quantity here for another recipe, so I am proofing this sour starter in two separate bowls for about four to eight hours or until the sour starter doubles in size. Back to the recipe. Use the hook attachment to mix the ingredients until the sour starter dissolves in the mix. Then add 500 grams or 4 cups of bread flour into the mixing bowl. Knead until all the ingredients are well combined. Then add little by little 100 grams or a quarter cup plus 3 tablespoons of butter cut in small pieces at room temperature. Add 8 grams or 1.5 teaspoons of sea salt and knead until the dough is soft, elastic and it doesn't stick to the walls of your bowl for about 20 minutes. Take the dough out of the bowl, place it on your working table, stretch the dough on itself and make a bowl of dough. Look at how smooth and soft this dough is, it is ready to proof. Place the dough in a grease proofing bowl and cover the bowl with a lid or a plastic wrap. Let the dough proof in a warm place for 4 to 8 hours or in the fridge overnight for at least 8 hours. Now make the filling for your bread. Place one bar of cream cheese or 225 grams in a mixing bowl. Add the zest of a mandarin. You can also use an orange or a lemon. Add 40 grams or a third of a cup of confectioner sugar and mix with a spatula until all the ingredients are well incorporated. Place the dough on your working table or a silicone mat and stretch it until you have a rectangle of about 18 by 14 inches or 45 by 35 centimeters. Spread the cream cheese filling on all the surface of the dough and add one cup of sliced raspberries and blueberries. Make sure to distribute the berries well on all the surface of the dough. Use your fingers to roll carefully the dough and use a bread knife to cut nine equal pieces of about two inches or five centimeters tall. Place the rolls in a nine by nine or 22 by 22 centimeter baking sheet. Cover the dough with a plastic wrap and let them proof in a warm place for at least two hours. Place the rolls in a preheated oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit or 200 degrees Celsius for about 25 minutes or until your rolls are golden brown. When your rolls are ready, take them out of the oven and let them cool off on a cooling rack. In the meantime, prepare the icing for the rolls. Mix 60 grams or 4 tablespoons of cream cheese with 1 tablespoon of milk and 40 grams or a third of a cup of confectioner sugar. Mix well until everything is well combined. When your rolls are at room temperature, use a spatula to spread the icing on and get ready to enjoy. These rolls are super delicious, very easy to make and very light with a delicious combination of flavors from the berries and the mandarin peel. Enjoy! Hey, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please click on the like button. And if you haven't subscribed, Please subscribe and I'll see you on the next video.